Okay, we've got the uh, the owner here telling us about the boat and uh, why it's good. So uh, we're going to start here with the custom live bait well. Okay, the live well is 30 gallons. It's lit. It helps the bait. You know, when you're running at night or early morning, the lids close. It's dark. It also has a circulating armature on it that goes around and an overflow. Down here, I have two batteries with the battery switch. You can control it, one, two, or turn it off. Oil reserve is down here. This is how you get access to your pumps. I also keep my wash down hose in here. There's the, the knob for that. This is really nice when you catch a fish and the blow something on the deck. You just screw this on, you get this pump, and the water starts going. Console. Uh, I had this redone. I had this moved up a little bit because I'm only five foot nine, so <laughs> it lets me get a little bit closer to it, so I can sit and see real easy. Marine radio, all the navigational lights, the switches, the horns, everything works. All your electronics are here, and they're lit. This is my GPS. It's a Garmin. There are probably 500 spots. It's my phone. And uh, this is my Lowrance. Little storage area here. I keep maps and various things in here. I kept most of that's kind of empty. This also a storage area up here. Just kind of nice. This is a real dry area. So you can throw anything you want to up here. You want to positively keep dry. What's that? The T top I got from Pacific Yacht Towers. It's two years old. It has four rod holders. This is all stainless steel. The lights work. And the antenna is located up above. This is uh, my ice area. You can keep the cold drinks or whatever in here. Put your ice in there. There's also four rod holders here and two cups. The overflow of any ice or water or any of the cups goes out and down through and back out the back of the boat. And the pad right here, you want to sit here. This is uh, my fish box. I throw a bag of ice in here. And this will hold quite a bit of fish. Hopefully you can be able to fill it up. It also has a plug in if you want to hold it and put water in there too. It has double straps. One. And then it has a locker strap. Up here in the front, I keep my life jackets, I keep flares, this type of thing. Uh, I keep extra ropes. And there's also some of these fenders that you're probably familiar with. The bumpers that hang over the side of the boat. Got it. Up here is my rod locker for your anchor. This is an extra rope. Uh, can we take it out? No. Nope. Okay. You're good. That's my anchor in there. This is just extra rope. Uh, what else do we have? A gaff that comes with the boat. You want that? Okay. Uh, there's a center console here that has a lot of storage in it. This has a strap right here. You can keep this open. You can lock it from the inside. Double thing. It has a porter potty inside. And also a nice little storage area. All your electronics and wiring are located right here. You can pull that canvas off and it gives you access to it. And there's a CD player right here. Got it. Okay. Okay. So in your words, tell us why this is the best boat. Uh, I've owned the boat a long time. It's never let me down. It always starts. It's very reliable. Uh, I've taken very good care of it. And uh, various other things you can have with it too, but it's just been a very reliable boat. I've had it out 55, 60 miles. Okay. Awesome. Um, well, thank you, sir. Okay.